Which one should I use among the showering systems? The difference between the different types of showering systems is really largely defined by three things. The size, the physical capability of the person who is in the wheelchair, and by the kinds of conditions that need to be addressed by the caregivers. When you compare the standard to the super standard, it's really a difference in this, the footprint of that unit. It's 36 inches by 36 inches versus 42 by 42 as the footprint between the standard and the super standard. And for the bariatric, it's 46 by 46. So the smaller the person is, the more they are able to just sit straight up, standard size wheelchair with their feet straight down, no reason they can't get by with the standard. If they need to have their feet on footrest, if they're a little larger, individual maybe up to 300 pounds or so, they can use a super standard. If they're larger than that, or if they have to be in a tilted chair, they can use the bariatric, which is 46 by 46. What if both of them wouldn't work? If a person has a condition where their leg needs to be straight out from the wheelchair, this is, there are possibly two alternatives, again, depending on the size or on the length. But the, the way to determine whether it would be a bariatric or a recliner style is that you would back the individual while they're sitting in the wheelchair with their leg up, back them up against a wall, and then just take a tape measure and measure outbound to the very tip of their toes. And if that distance is less than 46 inches, they can probably use a bariatric size stall. If, however, it's more than that, that's what the recliner style is for. It's got a full six feet of depth. So they could wheel into the reclining style chair with their leg completely out and still be able to receive a complete shower.